Hey guys and welcome to another episode of Modular, where today we're carrying on our ramble through the augments released in update 18.4.7 by taking a look at the augment for Equinox's Rest and Rage, Calm and Frenzy. Much like Metamorphosis, it's a very simple augment. Basically it means any enemy that dies while the rest or rage ability is affecting them will spread the ability in a 5 meter radius for the remainder of the duration of the ability. As I say, I mean it's pretty simple. The radius got the same base rage, uh, the base range as both rest and rage, and is being affected by range mods. So if the radius of the ability after mods is 10 meters, then the radius of the augment will also be 10 meters. Obviously, if you increase the duration of the base ability, it's going to affect the remaining time on the spreading from the augment. As with the other Equinox augments, you can pick it up by gaining the rank of Maxim with Arbiters, or Flawless with New Loka, and spending 25,000 standing to purchase. So, what do I think of this augment? To be honest, it's got one major flaw to me, and that is I feel that both Rest and Rage could do with a range buff. The base range of just 5 meters is too small. Um, to get any reasonable range out of it, you have to stack range on range. And even then, with 250% range, you only hit 12.5 meters with it, and that is pretty much nuking the rest of the frame to do it. As such, the augment suffers from that as well. Each kill on a rested or rage target still only has that 12 meter range at max. So a lot of the time, there's there's almost literally nothing in range for it to affect, especially against any of the factions that are using long range weapons. Now I know this sounds like I think the augment sucks, and that is not true at all. There are times which it can be useful, against the infested for example, or when you combine it with a radial disarm Loki, even a speed nova, even normal use, it can be somewhat effective, for example locking down choke points with it, um, combining it with the Naramon Master Race, or as I said before, even against the Infested. Um, it can be a very effective augment. I just wish the base ability had more range to begin with. I really feel that is what is holding it back. I like the augment, I really do. Definitely not useless, definitely not unusable, but I think with a bit of tweaking, it could be an absolute stunner. Right now, it is worth buying. It is worth putting on if you have room. Just be aware, it can be hit or miss whether it's going to help you out much in a mission. You get, you, well, you might get lucky. You might get a choke pointy map where it will make the most out of the short range. Or you will luck out and, well, you just get no luck whatsoever. Get a wide open map where the augment doesn't have the chance to do anything at all. At which point it becomes a wasted mod slot. So basically, Calm and Frenzy, it's a decent augment, if a little bit hit or miss. It's worth the standing to pick it up for sure, just be aware that you aren't always going to get the most out of it. As always guys, many thanks for watching, and I shall see you in the next video.